Good morning guys. Today I'm going to give you a little tour of the space that we're living and training in this month. In this building we've got myself, Arisa, one other artist, then two riggers and our rehearsal manager. And then over here... In this other house, I'm not sure how many rooms they have, but the eight other artists are staying in there. And then there's another little cottage here with two more rooms, I think, for any guests who might arrive. And at this hour of the morning, this is what our view looks like. Then breakfast is served until 9am, so I'm going to go and grab some before we start warming up for the day. Ah, morning kitty. This is Ronnie, the farm cat. So that's breakfast done. Next, I've got to do a little COVID test. I'm not going to film that for you. And then we'll check out the studio and then the barn, the big space. Outside of creation time, this is used for yoga and yoga retreats. You can see they've got a nice equipment here for 20 plus people at a time, I guess, and all kinds of nice books to read on your time in the middle of nowhere. So yeah, this is the studio. This is kind of a personal rehearsal space and where we normally warm up between like nine and 10 just after breakfast. And then after that, uh, small rehearsals, maybe choreography and personal stuff is in here. And then bigger things like rigs, sear wheel, or like show run throughs are going to be in the barn, which I'll show you in a minute. So people should be arriving soon as breakfast has just finished. And then, uh, yeah, we'll get on with the day. Alright, all warmed up and ready to go to the barn. Gonna do a bunch of choreographies this morning, maybe run through the show, then lunch, then run through it a bit more. Let's go have a look. very productive morning we had in the barn. Unfortunately I can't show you any of the footage or really tell you what we're working on. But now it's lunchtime. During this creation period with Creative Eva they've actually got a chef who delivers us. I think they would do it on site but because of Covid they're delivering us three meals a day which is pretty rad. A good selection also like vegan, vegetarian and all your dietary requirements as well. So I think we're going to head there, get some food, and then another hardcore afternoon. We are 10 artists out here from 
Colombia, Brazil, Argentina, Australia, England, Japan, France, Poland. I think that's everyone. And then we've also got a few choreographers and riggers and a big admin team. And we're all out here at uh, the Centre de Création, which is a, like I said, a sort of converted farm in the middle of the countryside in the south of France. Really beautiful place. Have a look at the view now the sun's come out. And we're all out here for about five weeks. Really family atmosphere. Everyone's really cool. Really, really nice place to just be and create. And what we've got to do out here is we're learning three shows which already exist. They are... And... Um, and then we've got to create two brand new shows. And after which we'll be going on board for about six months to perform all of those five. So it's also a nice sort of team building exercise to spend a month out here in the countryside. And get to know each other as a family, as a group of people before spending six months in close quarters together on a little metal box at sea. Yeah. So we just finished lunch and um, we've got some other stuff to do this afternoon, work on little bits and then a few more run-throughs later. That'll take us through to about 7pm. So let's get on with that. And we're finished for the day. And it's night time. Always weird to go in a room, daytime, come out at night time. Um, yeah, now it's dinner time. I feel like half this video is me going and getting food. But that's pretty much what a day in the life looks like at the Centre de Création for this period. Saturdays are a half day, and then Sunday is a day of rest. But really it's a day of revision and free training. But Monday to Friday is like that. Yeah, that's it. If you have any questions and I'm allowed to answer them, then let me know and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.